What's going on, y'all? What's going on? Forget all it. Look, I'm right here. Y'all see that? I'm right here at the freaking. I'm right here at the freaking scale, y'all. And I tell you what, dude. I just had the hardest time, like, y'all. I went in there to use the restroom. You know what I'm saying? And eat, get something to eat. And before I did that, I scaled my load. I always scale your load because y'all remember my last video. I was I almost got hit. Look, the DLT almost got me. So I'm like, dude, I, I was only 100 over on my steer tires, right? And I'm like, dude, I'm thinking about just going, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm on a fuel, uh, uh, I'm on a full take of fuel, right? So I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, dude, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go, but I'm just like, uh, I ain't trying, I'm, I'm on my way home, I'm headed home. I don't want no crazy stuff. I ain't trying to get no ticket or nothing like that. Y'all, I have been off duty right there. been off duty mess with sliding this fifth wheel back and forward dude for an hour and 12 minutes dude I just got done and I had to reweight the first uh, the first one is you know what I'm saying? I was a hundred uh, pounds over as you guys can see in the video right there and then when like dude I, I've been sliding this thing back and forth for dude forever dude I just got so frustrated now my last one is 11,620 and then my drives, as you, you can see it in the video, man. I'm sweating, I'm tired. But look, guys, I'm going to tell you guys, because I know some of you guys going to struggle with this just like I struggle, right? You, this is what you do, man. Okay, this is this is the release. Bam. And then to put it back in lock, right? You know, you want to release it when you want to slide the fifth wheel. And then you want to lock it, when, you know what I'm saying, once you get done sliding it. But the thing was, for me... I was I was I was easing on the gas I was easing on the gas and dude it will overslide it will overslide right shut up I gotta tell my people the goods man because I just struggled bad with this y'all so hopefully I can help somebody so my problem was y'all I had to spray it they give you spray in your little box right there y'all see that little box right there that gets sprayed it if you don't slash your um your fifth wheel often It'll get stuck and stuff like that. But my problem was, it was right here in this hole right here, y'all. But I kept sliding, trying to slide it. But every time I slide, it'll jump all the way to this hole. But that was too much. It'll put too much on my uh, on my drives. Instead of I was trying to get the um, I was trying to get it off my stairs. But it kept going to this one, or it'll end up in the middle. So I was I've been sliding back and forth. It went all the way back here. And then it went all, it was up here at first, y'all. So the thing is, if if you want to slide it, right? If you want it to go to the back, you gotta go forward. If you want it to go to the front, you gotta go backwards. You get what I'm saying? But I'm gonna show y'all this little trick, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all this little trick because this is what I did. Now, a lot of you guys might be thinking like, man, this just common sense. But dude, I just struggle, and I know a lot of guys gonna struggle with this. Now, once you're sliding, what I was doing was, I was keeping this open, right? I was keeping it wide open. But if you just, if you slide and you're trying to get to the next one, don't keep it open, right? You close it, and then set your brakes, set your, uh, set your trailer brakes so they, your trailer won't move, and have this pushed in so you can move the tractor right but but that's what you want to do y'all that's exactly what you want to do you want to slide it with the thing go i done got somebody behind me <laughs> somebody behind me y'all i gotta get ready and go y'all but i'm gonna move forward i locked that thing i'm gonna move forward so i can keep talking to y'all man i'm just moving forward a little bit maverick don't freaking try to find me man i'm just telling my people what's going on man and uh i'm gonna get ready and go y'all but yeah man i uh that ain't stupid you don't wanna but yeah y'all dude i just had the hardest time the hardest time y'all so hopefully this video can help somebody out y'all i'm gonna get cut off the camera y'all know what's going on because y'all know i'm ever gonna try to get on to me y'all know y'all know until next time man <laughs> forget that i wasn't done with my video y'all look man I hope that this video can help somebody out, y'all. <laughs> forget if they rushing all that, forget all that kind of stuff. I'm helping my people out, man. 
I just had the hardest time, y'all. So if you guys have any questions, man, you give me a call. I, man, look, you can call me, man. Y'all know y'all can call me. I talk to people all the time. You know what I'm saying? My number's in the description. Well, my email is in the description. Email me first, and then I will I will give you a call. You know what I'm saying? But well, guys, we about to get ready to head down to Memphis to, div to deliver this load, and I'm about to go see my girls. Y'all, y'all call me. Y'all message me anytime you guys want. Y'all know it's all love my way. Y'all my people, man. Y'all my people. Look, somebody said for me. Come on, this the real deal. Somebody said for me. We trucking, man. We trucking. So until next time, y'all. <laughs> Promise that you'll never be lonely